5 Ways You Can Get Ischemic Heart Disease As more and more days pass, we see diseases like heart failure and heart attack getting typical and expected. As unfortunate as that sounds, heart disease is one of the most commonly occurring diseases happening worldwide. In the U.S. alone, roughly 647,000 people die every year from heart disease. Although many kinds of heart diseases are widespread, the most common one is ischemic heart disease. In this disease, a person feels chest pain or discomfort due to the heart not receiving enough blood to function. This condition mainly occurs when the heart gets too excited or pushes too much exertion. This is when nature requires more blood flow. It is called coronary heart disease and is quite common in the United States. The signs and symptoms of ischemic heart disease may gradually show when the arteries become blocked. Here are five ways you're getting ischemic heart disease if you're not careful enough. 1. Diabetes One of the most common and endangering ways of getting ischemic heart disease is by having diabetes. It is widely known that diabetic patients are most prone to getting cardiovascular diseases due to many complications in the body. If you have higher blood sugar levels, glucose in the bloodstream will not allow the arteries to function well. It'll cause damage. With the stiffening of the arteries, it'll become harder for the heart to work well. This is due to not getting enough blood as required, leading you to a heart attack or a stroke. The best way to take precautions from any severe illness due to diabetes is by being strict towards your lifestyle from now onwards. 2. Smoking Smoking is the most terrible way of exhausting your whole body and damaging your organs. It ruins your physical health and makes you become less immune to any disease. Smoking is the leading cause of lung cancer that we have all heard once or twice in our lives, but it also damages many other organs. Smoking reduces the amount of oxygen that can be carried from your blood cells to your bloodstream. It contains toxic substances like carbon monoxide and nicotine, which trigger symptoms of coronary artery disease. This is the reason why long-term smokers might have ischemic heart disease. 3. Hypertension High blood pressure or hypertension is also a very crucial problem for everyone. This disease is very closely related to ischemic heart disease due to being concerned with the heart. The elevated blood pressure levels in the arteries have a high chance of giving you coronary heart disease. A study shows that 45% of the adults living in the U.S. have hypertension. Since the heart is not getting enough blood, you may likely experience a fatal heart issue if the hypertension is not controlled at the right time. 4. Obesity As much as people promote self-love with obesity, it is much likely that it is promoting self-injury. Yes, it is essential to love yourself enough to accept yourself. Still, it is also vital to love yourself enough to save yourself from several fatal and harmful diseases. Obesity is the primary and leading cause of most cardiac issues all over the world. Not only cardiac problems, but neurological and psychological issues are also caused by obesity. Adults who are obese are highly likely to get ischemic heart disease. Suppose you're obese and suffer from diabetes. In that case, it is better to take action towards a healthier lifestyle than to regret it later. 5. Family History Why do we see people getting a heart attack because their forefathers got or their father got? The linkage between heart diseases and family history is surprisingly relevant. Suppose several of your family members have suffered from heart disease. In that case, you're at a much higher risk of getting ischemic heart disease in the future. If someone in your family develops heart disease, you should instantly get your special screening to know where you stand. Special screenings are excellent and have provided 40% of the people with help to overcome sudden heart attacks. Ischemia happens due to a shortage of blood supply to your heart. Family history will eventually repeat itself in your body if you don't take control and approach proactively. Thank you.